It's like seeing a polar bear on the plains of Africa. It's, it just doesn't belong here. The fish are popular in aquariums. So scientists suspect that unwanted pets may have been released by their owners into Atlantic waters. The first sightings began about 20 years ago. Here's one here, look. We are clearly doing very, very well. You can see this other one right up here, just sitting on the ledge. They're everywhere. It's unbelievable. It's more of them than anything else. These ornate fish are one of the ocean's most poisonous creatures. They have spines on their fins. At the base of these spines are venom glands containing a neurotoxin. When the spine punctures a victim, the toxin is released. Old wives' tales would say that fishermen who would grab lionfish and try to pull them out of their nets would get stung and they would throw themselves overboard and commit suicide because the pain was so excruciating. But the venomous spines aren't the real danger here. So far on this dive, the lionfish is the only relatively large fish that Philippe and Lucy have seen. These invaders are skilled and efficient hunters that decimate the native fish population. Wow, he's eyeballing something. He's just kind of sneaking up on it. Whoa, he, did you see that? He just, he just went after something. Oh, yeah. Oh, Ooh. wow. That is so rare. Typically, lionfish are nocturnal feeders, and for him to have done that it just shows just how voracious and deadly these creatures are. And because they're new here, the native fish don't yet recognize them as predators. All the little fish swimming around it, they're just sort of hanging out there. So the idea of, a, you know, identifying it as a predator, you know, they haven't acknowledged that as yet. Look at them, they're, they're almost following it at the moment. Lionfish target young fish, which are easily caught. The native fish population is in danger of being wiped out. That was the problem in action. This is bad news for the health of this ecosystem. Bad news for potentially important fish for the other creatures that live here that are part of the natural order of this food chain. And it's getting worse. Lionfish have few natural predators in the Atlantic, so their population is exploding. From just a handful 20 years ago, there are now countless lionfish and they've spread from the Caribbean as far north as Rhode Island. For me, it was just the way that the other fish were just sort of hanging out around them, as if they had no fear or any indication that they, they were their predators. They were everywhere. You know, I was looking for grouper, I was looking for parrotfish, just keeping my eye out for things that should be here and I didn't see any of them in the abundancy that I saw lionfish. That's very worrying. You know, I don't think there's anything we can do about it. I really don't, except for try and learn so that if it happens again with another species, we're a little more prepared to deal with it. I think that's about all we can, we can hope for, which isn't much.